Hey everyone and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. On this video we're getting a gold medal on the mission, preaching forgiveness as he went. And pick this one up from Lenny, who is on the other side of the camp. So I'll have to power walk over to him. Despite it being super late and most people being asleep, I still am not allowed to run. And random autosave. Arthur! Yes, kid. You got a lot on? Ah, uh, just hunting for all this hillbilly gold that Dutch and Hosea seem to think is out there just waiting to be stolen. <laughs> Why? I got something. Could be good. Yeah? Yeah, I was in Rhodes talking to some of the colored folk. They said there's a gang of fools holed up in the swamps east of here who think their war ain't never ended. The Civil War? Yeah, apparently it's still raging in these fools' minds 30 years later. Okay. That ain't my point. These ignorant fools are weapon dealers. And in their dealings, sometimes sit on a decent pile of cash. Yeah, been selling weapons to Cuba and South America for years. Anyway, the old boy I was talking to reckoned there might be a bunch of cash just sitting around. And failing that, maybe a nice stash of weapons. With just a bunch of crazies, Gardner? Exactly. Well, worth taking a look at least, isn't it? That was my thinking. Said it was at some place called Shady Bear, deep in the woods. Okay. <laughs> All right, then. Let's go rob some food. Alright, so to get the gold medal on this mission, you'll need to complete it in 11 minutes and 30 seconds or less. And you also can't use any healing items. Come on, it's this way. On me. I might have met these crazies before. You've been drinking again? No. Well, yes, but no, that's not how I might have met them. I think some of them harangued me and Sadie when we were coming back with supplies. Mrs. Adler? Yeah. And Mrs. Adler did just fine. More than fine, actually. She's terrifying. But I got a notion these fellers is one and the same. Yeah, we won't find no shortage of angry Peckerwood idiots in the state of Lemoyne. That's for sure. Is it really that different in this state? We haven't come far. It seems like it is. These boys got a manner about them, but I haven't necessarily noticed. All respect, Mr. Morgan. You wouldn't notice. Might call you a nigger lover. They see us riding like this. But most of it is a... Uh, a glance or a word. And after that, a visit in the night. Well, out west, it's... Out west is out west. And you're all who you are. Right? Decent folks. But some places down here, they judge differently. Well, I don't know. Guess it can't be so easy for you, Lenny. Sorry you're caught up in this. Well, I guess their gold's still shiny. And their guns still shoot. <laughs> so I'm game for robbing any and every one of these bastards for all they got. <laughs> okay, then. Plus, it beats being lynched back in Blackwater with all of you by my side. I guess it does. Feels like we're close. It's a rundown old plantation house down in the bayou somewhere. Let's take it slow. Be cautious. If, like you say, these crazies are sitting on weapons, we're gonna wanna strategize a little before getting shot at. <laughs> of course. They said find the old battlefield and keep on going. 
Well, we got some wrecked old Civil War weaponry. Now where are the wrecked old Civil War holdouts? You see that church up ahead? They're supposed to use it as an outpost. Heard they got men going between here and the big house all day. Okay. Look at this field. <laughs> Imagine getting caught up in a fight like this. Yeah, I don't care to. Hold those reins in. Let's just take a look around the place. I hear you. Uh, it doesn't look like anyone's here. We don't know that for sure. Let's have us a nosy. All right, quickly inspect this structure. We will put that into the journal. And we'll read that later. Hear that? Someone's on the track. Look there, the wagon. Let's see where he's going. You're on me now. Right behind you. Let's keep our distance. Just two fellers out on the road. Hey, that looked like dynamite in the back there? It looks like we're on to something. I thought we were hanging back. Got a little too close. I think I see something. End of the avenue, between the trees. Might be it. Might be. Keep it steady. Hey, big plantation house. <laughs> Must be Shady Bell. I reckon we can leave our mounts up there, off the trail. Good enough to me. Come on. We can get a view on them from that wall up there. Make sure you bring the sharpshooter. I'll take the other side. You get in cover there. All right, so you need a long scope rifle, but it'll give it to you automatically. Yeah, let's take a look. Did you see anything? Yes. Yes. They're here, all right. And they're armed. Almost a militia. Down by the road. We do well to draw them into one spot if we're gonna make a pass at this. What else? I know dynamite crates when I see them. We got something, right? Oh, we got something. We can hit them head on, fight them honest. Or you could go down there acting friendly. Friendly? With these folks? Just draw them into one spot, then I'll start shooting. <gasps> Well, that might be the dumbest idea I've ever heard. But hey, I'm always up for performance. It is fun to send Lenny, but let's shoot the dynamite. We're gonna hit him head on. You save your play acting for Jose and the girls. <laughs> Fine by me. I'll go. All right, we need 10 kills with this rifle. And there's one. Oops, screwed that up. Oh, how did that miss? There's two. Three. Four. Five. Save Lenny. Ah, oh, dang it. There's six, almost. Six. Seven. Eight. Make it nine. Ten. Let's get one more just to be safe. Oh, he lived through that. Oh, well. That's fine. Pretty sure I got my ten. Oh, crap. How did that not work? 
There. <laughs> oh, I threw it with the stare down. I love it. Come on, show me your face. There we go. You know, if I can, let's try to kill this guy with the scope rifle. Ah, oh, crap. Get off of me. Ugh, alright, fine, whatever. Okay, moving on. That's all of them. Sure can. We'll check the rest later. Now, come on. Let's go. All right. Hopefully, let's I got go, my ten go. kills. Get this back to camp. Yep. A little worried about that. I'm pretty sure my accuracy was just fine. We need to get these back. Yeah, yeah, we're going. Come on. G up. Oh, well, you ain't side with the wind. Rider, coming our way. Keep it together. Hey, stop! What's a black feller doing coming out of Shady Bell? In one of our wagons. Defuse. We was uh, doing some business with your brothers back there. You don't look like any kind of folk we deal with. Our business was conducted to the satisfaction of all parties. Until now, that is. Nope. No. Something don't feel right about this. Not him and not you neither, Yankee. Get these lying bastards! Right, let's go! Oh. All right. Yeah. Didn't need to miss that shot. Leonard, Leonard, Leonard. I'm looking, all right? I can't see anyone chasing us. I should think we're out of the woods then, so to speak. Uh, boy, oh boy. <laughs> you did good. <laughs> we did it. Well, let's get to camp before saying anything like that. I know Sean's been bringing in quite a lot lately, and I wanted to... <sighs> it's good to have something to show like this. Sean's a loudmouth bragger. Don't worry about what Sean does. Hey, I like him, you know? Well, so do I. Guess my better judgment just... You worry about you. He wasn't on Leviticus Cornwall's train with me. We had to dig him out of Blackwater. But... That's not but nothing. Me and Dutch, and everyone who counts, we know what you do for this gang. We notice. Keep it up. You're gonna start seeing things change for you. Okay, then. Okay. Thank you, Arthur. in these trees up here. Let's get there. Arthur, Lenny, coming back. These are fine rifles. Right? I'm gonna keep one, just for me. Hey, I always enjoy riding with you, kid. <laughs> you know how to fight. Hey, you too. Anytime, Arthur. All right, we got a bolt action rifle. Fancy new gun, and hopefully our gold medal is about to pop up. 
Hey, there it is. Good. I did get those 10 kills. I was a little worried about it. Sometimes you'll hit people with a long scope rifle and they'll live. All right, so we are now 28% through the story. Chapter 3. Preaching forgiveness as he went. Uh, following a lead about the Lemoyne Raiders sitting on a pile of weapons, Lenny and Arthur ride out deep into the woods towards Shady Bell. Alright, so we killed 10 Lemoyne Raiders with a long scoped rifle. We completed the mission within 11 minutes and 30 seconds. We completed the mission with at least 70% accuracy, and we completed the mission without taking any health items. Also, we have an update to our compendium, which is now 183 of 553. And, uh, let's see, that would be weapons. Oh, jeez, where is it in here? There it is, the bolt-action rifle. The BD and company bolt-action is a strong and versatile rifle, built to perform in any environment. The bolt-action mechanism allows for quick firing and reloading, making this rifle an ideal choice for long-range combat, with multiple targets. This gun has an ammo capacity of 5 rounds and can use regular, high-velocity, split-point, express, and explosive rifle ammo. All right, uh, well, let's see if anything is happening at the camp. What's up, Strauss? Talk to Lenny. Ah, okay. Got some weapons you could sell. Okay, well, let's talk more later. Sounds good, Mr. Morgan. Who's hanging out over there? That's Javier. Hey, Javier. Ah, good morning, Arthur. Don't forget about all that money out there. Of course not. Anyway, you know what to do. Sounds good. You ain't gonna turn us in, are you? How are you? <laughs> Karen. What you up to? Just minding my own business. Okay, keep it that way. See ya, Arthur. Well, doesn't appear to be much going on here. I haven't talked to Abby in a while. Hello. My lady. Good morning, Arthur. You know, you should get out of here for a bit. God, that'd be nice. Well, we all need a break. Okay. All right, well, doesn't appear to be anything happening. So we're going to take off. And uh, let's do a little bit of hunting. Maybe I'll do like a big circle. Try to get some boars. I still want boars. And uh, I don't know. We'll end up somewhere near town. So eventually I'll make my way to that waypoint. Hopefully, I can find an Oriole out there. Yep. Make up for that one that got away from me. And my dead eye currently sucks. Let's fix that with some salted beef. Oh, gonna need more than that. A little bit more. Meh, that's good enough. Uh, let's see. We will use some opened snake oil. All better. What do we got? Any birds out? Preferably of the hey, Oriole variety? That here. one could be. Over here. Oh, well. Please, friend. You gotta help me out here. Come on, please. I'm about done here. If I don't get these shackles off soon, I'm a goner. Please. I've been told you can take these guys to the sheriff's office. And I guess it's time for us to find out. Good lord! You're one- ah! I'm gonna make you regret this, you dumb piece of shit. 
Alright, did you pick up anything when you escaped? So while you're here... One cent! Heck yeah! Alright. Can I take you to the sheriff? I am technically a lawman. This could get bumpy. You alright, girl? Hmm. Well, only one way to find out. Guess we're going to that waypoint sooner. Oh wait, what was that? Yeah, I lost it. Whoa, whoa, you done good, girl. Easy now. Oh, there's a snake. That's what my voice is freaking out. Was that a snake I have? Nope, that's a rattlesnake. That is new. And I got it. That is a timber rattlesnake. The timber rattlesnake is native to Lemoyne, New Hanover, and parts of West Elizabeth. As carnivores, they prey on small birds, mice, rabbits, and lizards. A bow with small game arrows is considered to be the best weapon to wound or kill a snake of this size. Their skin can be used for crafting, and their meat can be used as a source of food. Good to know. Oh, and my horse could use a little bit of love. Here you go, horse. Have some okay, oat cakes. Is there a bird in that tree? Something's moving in that tree. Or is that just leaves falling off? Oh, there's some ravens there. Alright, I don't see anything. Turned around. Where am I? Oh, never mind. Ah, yes, I know. Oh, and you know what? I wonder if I can do that one uh, activity, I guess we'll call it. I'll find out in a minute. Anyways, let's see if this guy can actually be turned into the sheriff. <laughs> sheriff Gray, I've got someone for you. someone would drag in this animal ha I can sweet where do I put him I guess just in the cell yeah uh, do I just drop him I guess I just drop him god damn um okay <laughs> I guess I'll just leave him. Alright, well, he's your problem now. I'll see you guys later. Just hoping to get some sort of reward, but, you know. Anyways. I did my civic duty. He's been returned. I've talked to this guy before, and uh, he's looking for some guy I've never found. Hey, is that a dog? I'd... Oh, I don't have that. That's like a poodle. Hello, dog. A poodle. Poodles can be found in the wealthy neighborhoods of St. Denis and Rhodes. Their omnivorous diet usually consists of dog food made up from meat, vegetable matter, and offal. Poodles are considered to be good duck and bird hunting companions. Good, go find me an Oriole. Find me an Oriole and I'll take you back to camp. Go 
Nice. Right, so where's, where's this guy looking for Gavin? I've lost my friend. Somebody help me, please. Good day, dear. Listen, have you seen? I'm looking for my friend Gavin. I don't know any Gavins, I'm afraid. English bloke. Lovely fella. He went missing, and uh, now I'm all alone. Good luck. Sorry, buddy. No that's, idea. Uh, that's too bad. Um, hi. Do I have this donkey? I don't. Hello, donkey. It's a standard donkey. Not like those premium donkeys. The standard donkey can be found at ranches and farms across the states. The herbivorous diet consists of grasses, hay, and barley straw. Donkeys are considered to be one of the cheapest forms of labor for agricultural work. And they're so cute. I am so worried. Gav! Gav! Uh, Gav! Clearly screaming his name over and over again is going to work wonders for you. Alright, let me... Oops! I don't know what I just killed. I'm just going to keep moving. Nobody saw that. Alright, um, so I'm gonna go to the weapon smith. Mister! Why did you leave me here? You gotta get me out, please. It's getting worse. Don't leave me down here, please. Oh, you're still down there? Yes, I'm still down here, because nobody will help me. Will you do something, please? Oh, wanted to question him some more, but all right, I'll help you. Why, well, welcome, partner. First time? All right. Um, you know, while I'm here, about the new faces in town, Rhodes is welcoming to be sure, but we can't just let all types have their way. While I'm here, let's go ahead and customize. We will customize the Cattleman revolver. Well, I don't know the accuracy. All right, never mind. Cattleman's the one with the great accuracy. That's the one I want to equip. Um, so let's see. Select that. Doesn't need a cleaning. Looks like you're taking care of that weapon. Good Opponents. I can improve the accuracy of that, you know. Now, I've been told that grips actually um, decrease the amount uh, that, or lower the, uh, or increase the amount of time it takes before a gun needs to be cleaned. I don't know if that's true or not. I haven't tested it, but that's what I've been told. So, uh, if that's a possibility, I like the ironwood grip, and that'll be ten dollars and fifty cents. Now, I do have iron when it's quality, but here in Rhodes, American is preferred. So we got that. What about a barrel length? We can get a long barrel. That'll increase accuracy for nine bucks. Let's do it. That'll help, I'm sure. Uh, rifling. We can get the improved rifling. For 11.25, that'll increase its range. Uh, iron sights. We can get the improved sights to increase accuracy further for $3.75. You'll appreciate the improvement. Well worth it. And I got the trophy locked and loaded for completely upgrading a weapon. Um, do I want... To make this look like super cool, can put different metals and stuff on it. It's kind of a waste of money at the moment. Later on, when I have tons of money, I'm sure I'll want it. Oh, and what is all this? Oh, you can repaint every part. Make it goofy as you want, or as awesome as you want. You can see these paints are about $13 to $16 each. Well, these ones are a little more expensive. But yeah, 
that's not exactly cheap. See Mr. Banks across the way there? He ain't the friendliest at first, but he's nice enough when you get to know him. Can also get engravings. Um, those are really subtle, though. You can zoom in, but even zoomed in, it's super subtle. And uh, full engravings, all I can do apparently. I guess so. Uh, then we can get carvings in the grip. You need anything special? You let me know. That's actually kind of cool. I like that eagle. Perhaps I will get an eagle. You know what? I'm doing it. 11.25. That's worth it. And then varnish. We can varnish the grip. Hmm. Do I care? That's what it's at. Normal. I actually kind of like the normal one. Now, I do have some foreign-made iron when it's quality. But here in Rhodes... American is preferred. Yeah, I'm just gonna stick with the uh, regular. Okay, looks good to me. And uh, let's also, I use the repeater a lot, so let's give that some upgrades. So we got components. That seems to be well taken care of. Got Barrel. Lots for that gun, you know. We can increase its range with improved rifling. Let's go ahead and do that. Um, iron sights. Three dollars and seventy-five cents for more accuracy. Oh yes. You'll notice the difference. That's an easy. Um, scope will increase its range. Ah, uh, I don't need a scope for this. Nah, I'm good. Uh, stock. Nah, I like the way it looks and wrap. Oh. Does that do anything? No, but it does look kind of cool. I heard cool. some unsavory things about that salesman, Virgil Fish or something. Let's see. It looks like that. Yeah, let's get that. Of it. That looks good. Wise investment. I like the way that looks. Uh, styles. Metals. Interested in engraving some? Make that weapon your own. I don't think I care about any of this. Nah. Not interested in any of that. Um, engravings. Oh, that's on the little handle thing? Yeah, you're never gonna see that. Oh, there we go. That, that's much more visible. Although I'm still not that interested. I keep away from the butcher's sausage. There's a reason he keeps the price so low. Yeah. Do not care. Carvings. Oh, well, you can't do it with a wrap. Leather? Oh, I can change the wrap color. Um, That's what it is. I make sure to test all my goods for quality and defects. That's a good Kind of like that. $3.38. We'll do it. Yeah, I like that. And what about varnish? Hmm, that's what it is normally. Maybe that. Maple. Ooh, actually, I like the mesquite. Like what you see? I'm a bit of a hunting enthusiast, as you may have surmised. Let's see, what does mesquite look like? Yeah, there we go. Ooh, I like it. Okay. That is good enough. Uh, ammunition, I think I'm all set. Yeah. Always good to have a full stock on ammunition. All right, so now that uh, we've gotten some use out of him, let's aim weapon. Rob the basement. I want to see what's in that basement of yours. Show me. Right now. Nothing to no worse down there, I swear. Why don't I be the judge of that? Open it now! All right, all right. I ain't got nothing to hide. I got my boy sleeping down there. That's such a shame. You to know, wake you him. can always come back after he wakes up. You, you just stay away. 
away from me. Now what I tell you about talking to your pa that way? Oh, oh, thank God. Don't shoot me, please. Just, just leave us be. Please, please help me. He, he's got me chained up here. Just what the hell is going on here? He was being a bad little boy, stealing candy from the store again. It's for his own good. I'm not your little boy, you mad son of a bitch. Why are you wearing that sailor suit? That crazy maniac put me in it. He thinks I'm his kid's son. Kidnapped me, he did. Do I look like a kid? <laughs> Always in such a rush to grow up these days, aren't they? All right, Don't well, we're helping this dude me. out. He's all I got. Please, don't listen to that maniac. He, he ain't my father. All right, I need a cattleman revolver. Can't lose him. Not again. Please shoot through these shackles. I, I can't spend another day down here. Oh, oh, finally! Thank you! Thank you! Oh, oh, oh you, you I'm sorry! Seven. Please forgive me. I know it was wrong. I just couldn't face that he was gone. I was teaching Sammy how to hold the rifle proper out by the river. The recoil? Shot him backwards. He slipped into the river. The water pulled him downstream so quick. It all happened so fast, I didn't know what to do. I searched up and down that river bank for days. But I couldn't find my boy. I just miss him so much. And you! You remind me of him. You look just like him. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. It's too late for apologies. You just count yourself lucky that I don't kill you for what you did. Don't know what else you want from me. Take what you want. I don't care anymore. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I feel a little bad, but I will take one weapon. What do we got here? All right, buddy, you're free. I won't kill you. Just don't freaking kidnap any more guys. Dress them up as sailors, you freak. Alrighty. Let's get out of here. Okay, we are back in Rhodes and we're gonna end things right here. So thank you for watching and I will see you next time.